So I'm here at the vet, and it's very possible that, you know, I might have to uh, put her to sleep. And I can say all the right things, like, oh, she's lived a good life. It's very logical. She's not having a high uh, quality life at the uh, recently, the past few weeks. Um, but before that, it was bad too, you know, and it's just really gotten bad these past few weeks. And it's just, she can barely get up. Um, she's going, uh, number one on herself consistently. And it's hard of hearing, uh, but it doesn't like get excited about her ball as much. Can hardly eat. Um, and I can say all that and it still hurts, you know? And she's my first dog, too, you know? You know, my first dog. Got her when I was in a sixth or a summer of after seventh grade. So, summer of 05. May of, and she was born May of 05. So she's close to over she's over she's 13, you know, and it's you know, it's just it's sad. I don't want her to go. I don't want her to be away. But you know, I want her to be a puppy again. But, you know, she's not. And, uh... I remember the first day I got her. And I couldn't drive at that point. And now, you know, <laughs> I'm driving now. To go put her sleep. Possibly, you know, but it's gonna be soon. You know, with them, you know, it's going to be soon. And, uh, I'm just upset about that, you know, but it's, I'm not the only one. It's not going to be the first time in my life either to put a dog down because I'm always going to have a dog in my life. But, um, that's just where I'm at in life. I'm just sad about it, upset about it. I wish that, uh, I wish it wasn't, I wish it wasn't like this. And, uh, no, no, you know, I'm thinking about what do I do with the body. I already, you know, have an idea and, and, um, I'm just sad about it, that's all. Okay. I love you. Love you guys. I'll see you later.